Hey guys, it's Midi Bia and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a very simple, easy hairstyle using be using beads. <laughs> so bands. Using beads and flat twists and yeah, let's get into it. So the first thing I'm going in with is the moisture milk from As I Am and if you guys watched my previous video you will know that I absolutely love this stuff and it's just to give my some moisture and some kind of yeah just to prepare for the styling that it's about to happen. So the first thing you'll need is a few bobby pins, I have about 5 or 6 and you'll need um, however amount of beads that you need in this case i'm using four and i got these from hair talks by tay and a pom pom so the first thing you want to do is you want to part your hair by so starting by the ear and you just might want to separate that from the back ear and just kind of create that path from the one ear to the other ear so that you have this whole kind of front path um, I'm just showing you the lines. You can make it as straight as you want to. I'm honestly not. I honestly don't care about how straight it is on my hair. But for you, you can do that. And um, just tie that back here. Yeah, I'm thinking about how cute this hairstyle actually looks. <laughs> if I'll ever, ever have the courage to actually rock it. But yeah. So the next thing you want to do is I'm just kind of parting it in the middle. Just to make sure that... Um, I have equal amounts of hair on each side and then just potting it again half on the one side so that I can get kind of map out where I am going to start off with my very first flat twist. So in this case we'll be doing four flat twists. So you part it in the middle and then you part, it again, part the half again in the middle. In the middle. So that's how you end up with four flat twists. So I'm just um, pinning this the hair on the one side to the back so that I can start on my first piece. So on the first piece I'm going to show you guys or explain to you guys step by step as I go through it. I use the perfect touch shine and hold wax and just use enough just to make sure that my edges are neat and that the head that I don't have any flyaways because we do not want that when we're doing a flat twist because we want to keep it as neat as possible so I mainly concentrate on the edges where I can just flatten everything and make sure that everything stays in place so what you want to do now is um, take a really small piece from the front because this this should be one of the pieces that you're going to start your flat twist with and I'm taking a really small bobby pin you can use any bobby pin that you want I just like the small one because it's easier to pull through the bead and you want to put the bobby pin as close to your edge as possible so I don't make it too close because I don't want to pull the hair out so I just keep it kind of lax um, yeah and I take the bead the opening of the bead and put it over the bobby pin so I'm just showing you here yeah, how it goes over the bobby pin and I pull the bobby pin basically through the bead the hole in the bead <laughs> yeah so it's as simple as that really not difficult at all so you just want to start off your flat twist and yeah I am just pushing the bead because the bead tends to move around what you can do is you can tie it down with like small elastics but I do not I prefer just doing it like this and I just push the bead in place so that once I start twisting it does not move with my twist and as you if you know a twist is just basically twisting the hair around each other and gathering the hair as you move to the back in this case there's not a lot of hair to twist so I just end wherever wherever it stops and I put a bobby pin down just to hold it in place okay so I'm going to speed through this because I don't want to bore you guys with the same process over and over again it's basically the same thing over just um, basically putting the bead on the first strand of hair that I use to, um, to flat twist and then just flat twisting up so that it goes in the same pattern as the bottom end. And yeah, I'm going to shut up right now. <laughs>
Phew, okay, so now that that's done, you just want to take a pump and off and fluff up your hair and just make it look presentable. Um, you can also just tie your hair up, do it like a half up to it, but I really like this one, I think it's a little different. And yeah, I just really like this hairstyle. So, that is basically the final look, guys. And that was the whole simple, super easy process. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please stay tuned for some more up, up and coming videos. I know I haven't been posting as regularly as I want to, but I promise I am trying my best. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!